Uh, hi guys, now we are back with another tutorial. Today's tutorial is very simple, probably gonna be my shortest tutorial ever. Uh, today I'm going to teach you how to do motion blur on 3D models animation. So first of all, I'm gonna need to open node video, open a new project. Uh, everything you need is in the description. And you're gonna get my 3D model pack and it's just going to pick any 3D model with any animations. I'm just going to choose this Ben Wolf model. So there we go. And turn on the animation, of course. And we just scale it how we want it to be. I'm just going to cut to when I'm done. Now, one thing you need to keep in mind is that if you're scaling it, you just want to want to scale one of these things and you're just gonna make sure that all of them have the same thing so that it's even and it looks good just like that pretty good and there we go so then once you once you've done that you're just going to keyframe your animation i'm just gonna keyframe it like that and if you want to know how to add more motion blur it's just that really fast things have more motion blur okay so now i've done i'm done keyframing uh i just let it let it just hold on a little bit more on here and okay and if you want to cut the 3d model or just want to cut any video or something you're gonna click this little thing while you have selected it and just gonna drag this and cut it right there so it's going to end there you can add a background stuff but I don't need to so I'm just going to add just uh, maybe a e purple background why not and yeah there we go and then you're just going to export it you can do whatever you want Okay, so once you've done that, you're just going to open a new project with the video you've exported. First of all, you want to make sure to delete the ending. And then you want to make sure that w before exporting, everything ends at the same time by using that cut feature that I just showed you. And then from here, it's very simple. Now, you can like... If you're making an entire video, you can make the entire video and right at the part where you want motion blur. So let's say I only want motion blur here. I can just split and add motion blur here. But I want motion blur on the entire thing. So you're just going to scroll all the way to this motion blur thing here. And you can make it however you want. But these are what are, this is how I usually do it look looks like this like this is usually like around here and this is usually around here both and twice is really good if you want that like clean motion blur look and it's just gonna wait for it to load okay and once it's done loading it should look like this and now if you see the video there you go there's motion blur as you can see now, uh, you might say there's like too much motion blur. Well, it's easy. There's two ways you can fix it. Either, either make this once or keep it twice and just lower this. But I think I'm just going to make it like this maybe. And yeah, wait for it to load again. You can make these settings however you want. Maybe test a bit. But yeah, and there we go. So you can basically just mess around with it, change some stuff, and uh, yeah, just know that if you split after you've done any motion blur, the motion blur will turn off on the two uh, splits. So you should just uh, make sure that you've done everything except for the motion blur when you want to export, and then add, add the motion blur last. Mm -hmm.